Okay, so we want to find the inverse function of this trig. Uh, it's not unlike any other trig function, so we just swap the x and y value. f of x is the same thing as just, uh, excuse me, y is equal to 7 sine of x minus 2. So we swap our x and our y values, and we solve it again, so we get y by itself. All right, so to do that, so I do x. Well, let me swap the variables. x is equal to 7 sine of y minus 2. All right, so x uh, plus 2 is equal to 7 sine of y. And I'm going to flip these around here. So sine of y, and I'm going to divide x plus 2 divided by 7, x plus 2 divide by 7, and then take the arc sine of both sides. So I get y is equal to arc sine of x plus 2 divided by 7. That's it. And this matches up with, this is the inverse officially, so the y could be uh, set up like this. All right, so this matches up with b. Oh, oops. Um, Actually, I take that back. It matches up with C. Forget my arc sign. That's it.